Hey all, so I've got myself into a bit of a problem where I can't delete this file because I've created it with essentially an invalid name and it's got corrupted because I was messing around with uh, creating files and directories in .NET and I've done it wrongly and created something that the Windows File Explorer or file system can't handle. So every time you try and do delete, whatever, it just doesn't work anything you try and do even the top level folder above just doesn't work so let's have a look okay and as per uh, stack overflow actually i've tried going through the suggested one they've given here that hasn't actually worked on super user instead which was pointed to on that post it took about 7zip and using that to amend the file name so i've actually got 7zip if you don't know it's just an open source sort of i, I always used it for, just for zipping funnily enough but clearly it can do more things so let's take that directory path now when I did the delete it deleted everything but the one I wanted to get rid of right so hasn't really helped me and I should be able to rename in here let's just rename it to a and finally I've got it back to where I needed it to and let's see hopefully ha <laughs> Oh, unbelievable okay it's because I've got stuff inside with again with corrupted it names dot dot so let's just rename that and let's see okay and there's nothing inside that so if I go back a folder all right you can see I don't know 7-zip all that well um, let's see if I can just delete this one yes okay okay fine that's not a problem and if I then work back I'm sure you could do it a more fancy way but that will work ah thank goodness for that and so then I should be able to delete the project directory at the top level here okay it's opening another yeah I accidentally opened this as we're doing this try again maybe because it's opening 7-zip maybe actually why not why not go up Ooh, something's crashing okay 7-zip doesn't like it because probably because I deleted the directory without closing it and let's try that okay it might be because opening my command prompts let's just close everything down let's see gone and there you go so that should then get rid of the project so I'll put the link to the super user forum post which was really helpful. I will be upvoting. Check out my next video here for more and I'll see you there. Thanks for watching.